Hi everyone, it's Friday and I've got another Tesco grocery haul. So I've just went and did our weekly shop. I'll tell you how much I spent at the end. Um, but I found that Tesco had a lot of stuff out of stock today. Um, but I'll show you what I got anyway. I'll just get straight into the freezer stuff. Um, please remember to like and subscribe if you're not already. And welcome back, by the way, if you have been here before. And if you've not been here before, I'm Leslie Ann and I'm a mum of two. live with my husband just outside Glasgow and I do grocery hauls, meals of the week, things like that. So I'd love for you to be here. But anyway, I'll just get straight in with the freezer stuff. So I got some more of these milk lollies because Eliza's going through these like no one's business. Um, as usual, I'll put the prices on the screen. So I got those and these little moons, right? These are £4.50, which is crazy, but I'm really going to try to justify this now, but they're really nice. I really like them. Um, and I actually walked past them and was like, nope, I'm not going to do it. But I've never tried these ones before and I really love the coconut ones. So I picked them up um, and I'm just going to savour them really and just have them for a wee treat at night time. Because they're only 82 calories and they just look really nice. So these are the Belgian chocolate and hazelnut ones. So I'm going to get those put away now. So I got some orange juice, a blue milk, a green milk, just our usual. Um, some more corner yogurts because we ran out of those and these Daily Dunkers they were on the club card offer so I always pick those up when I get them on offer because I do think they're a bit pricey when they're full price. I also got these little things, these were on offer as well so I got some olives and garlic with chilli and some feta stuffed peppers. I just like having those kind of things in um, in the fridge and I ran out of butter so I got two lots of the salted butter. Got this for Jamie, uh, just a chicken and bacon pasty and just some eggs as well. For cold meat, these were on offer two for three pounds. I got some corned beef and some roast chicken. Um, for meat this week, I feel as if I always buy the same meat. Um, I'm going to try and change it up next week because I like to have pork loins. Um, this week's Meals of the Week next Wednesday that I'm going to put up is that I use a pork loin um, in the slow cooker and it was lovely. So I'm going to start buying more stuff like that because I always buy steak mints. So that is just a staple. It's just so versatile and I can use it in so many different dishes. Um, so I got some of that. I got some chicken breast fillets because the date was really good on it. And I'm going to have, I got these um, fajita kit, um, no, enchilada kits in my recent cherries haul. If you've not watched that, go check it out. Um, the cheesy baked enchiladas. So I got that because I'm going to have that one night this week. Um, hopefully that'll be nice. i um, got some macro fillets either for a dinner or at lunch. Um, some smoked pork sausage for a pasta bake, a large whole chicken because we're going to have a roast chicken on Sunday and some onion slice. This is the best see, for a roll and slice. I actually don't even have any rolls but see a piece and slice that's just my favourite. Just bread, butter, brown sauce, onion slice. It is lovely. Um, and onto fruit and veg. I didn't really get a lot actually looking at this now but I've still got some stuff in the fridge that I'm going to use up like peppers and stuff like that. Um, and I've already got onions and I didn't need to buy more potatoes because I already have some. So I'll start at the back. I got some sweet potatoes because they were going through these so quickly. Some carrots, a cauliflower, a bunch of bananas, some of these candy floss grapes. It's like candy floss. Even though three pounds, I mean, it's a bit pricey, I would say. But anyway, I spent four pounds on ice cream, so I can't really complain, can I? Um, I got some baby plum tomatoes. I always have those in. Some blueberries. Some leeks and avocado. This feels actually quite ripe. This will be ready. Actually, I've got, let me show you my nails as well. I got my nails done today for the first time in, I want to say, a year, maybe more. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but I just got um, shellac with like colourful tips and I love them. So, yeah. Um, I got some extra fine green beans because they were cheaper than the other ones in their Tesco finest. So, I got those. Right, onto the cupboard stuff. I got these 10 calorie strawberry um, jellies because I thought that would be quite nice instead of reaching for a biscuit or something like that, something sweet and um, Eliza could have a wee jelly for a wee change now and again as well. Ran out of sugar for teas. Um, these Grace bars were on offer and as usual you know that I always buy these when they're on offer so I got the cocoa vanilla flavour and the peanut butter flavour, peanut butter chocolate flavour. Um, some coffee, Jamie ran out of his filter coffee, that Taylor stuff that I got last time that was on offer, but this Costa coffee was on offer this time, so I got that. It's quite a small bag, but I'll see how long that lasts. Up the back there, I've got some lime cordial, some orange and lemon pineapple and cherries and berries, because I'm all out of that, um, go through that so quickly just now. Just 
back down here I got some peach and juice I like having that for um, Eliza's um, yogurt I like putting that in there and all I can have is finger food as well two lots of prunes and a strawberry yogurt and um, bread I got some butter brioche rolls sliced fruit loaf Jamie and the kids have been loving that and best of both hope it's best of both I think it was 99p Crisps all I got was hula hoops because I've already got a lot in and I also got some toiletry stuff so I got this, this was on offer, it's in the jasmine and rice milk flavour, never tried that one before, I thought I'd get that for a wee change, normally I always buy the pink one, um, Jamie needed more of this um, clay thing for his hair. And this was in the kind of discounted section and this is the um, shampoo that I swear by because I tried using Pantene and it was rubbish. I actually think it's ruined my hair um, because I changed to it and used that and it was just terrible. It didn't work my hair and my hair is like quite in bad condition again. So I'm going to go back to using this. Um, so in their really massive bottles, can't remember how much but obviously the price will be on the screen. Also stocked up on nappies, so I got two lots, the bigger ones and the little ones. I normally always buy Pampers, but the big one I tried the big ones of um, the Tesco version and I really like them. Um, so I thought I would get the smaller version of Tesco and see if they're any good as well. If not, I would just go back to Pampers. Also topped up on some ready-made milk as well, finally, and some toilet roll that was on offer in the club card offer. So I think it's then just under £100. I put the price on the screen now, um, which isn't too bad. Um, if you want to see what I make with all of this, come back and check out um, my meals of the week because I'll rustle up something with all of this and you'll be able to see a week of family meals as well. So, um, yeah, um, actually I've been to Primark um, today as well. Um, so if you're going to leave here, um, I might just pop that in now if you're interested in seeing what I picked up in Primark. Um, but if you're leaving me here, thank you so much for watching as usual and Please remember to like and subscribe and comment and I will see you in my next video. But if you're interested in seeing what I got in Primark, keep watching. This is just a wee quick look of what I got in Primark. So I'll start over here. I got two of these hair bands. Um, these were only £2. So I got those and I got some scrunchies. But I couldn't resist when I saw these things here. So I got those. They were £2 as well. Little scrunchies with little dots on it. I thought they were really cute. I got this leather mini skirt. Um, this was... A, oops. I got a size 10, size 10 on the bottom and these, this was £8 and I tried it on as well so it fits and that would be nice for going into autumn with some tights and some boots. Um, same idea with this dress, I just saw it and thought it looked really nice. Um, this was, so this is a kind of long, kind of cream polka dots with long sleeves and a sort of ruffled little cuff bit. Um, so hopefully that fits because I got a size 8 so I'm not sure whether I should have went for the size up but that's £13 but hopefully that with like some tights um, and boots would be quite nice and I also got this um, little top um, and that was £11 down to £6 and it was like kind of puff sleeves and a nice little, I've tried this one as well, it's really nice on. It looks a wee bit big here, but um, it's like nice and puffy. And then I really like this bit, this neckline as well, it's really flattening. So I got that and I like the colour as well. I don't know if it's coming up very well, but it's like a pale blue. And I got a couple of bits for Ollie as well. Um, so these, oh, never put new shoes on the table. Oh, no. So I got these little um, khaki shoes, um, they were down to a pound, which was brilliant. Um, so I got a size 5, um, so they'll be when he's a wee bit bigger, and a size 3, look how cute they are. He'll be in them soon enough, and that was a pound as well. And I also got a couple of little t-shirts for him as well, which I didn't realise, I actually picked up two of the same one. Um, but these were down to a pound as well. Um, so yeah, I, both, I got the same one. But you know what it's like with babies that age, they're weaning and they get food everywhere so the t-shirts get ruined so it's actually not a problem. I picked up two and they were only a pound. So yeah, that was just my little mini pre-mark haul so I hope you liked that. Um, but yeah, I will see you in my next video and please remember to hit that like and subscribe button and have a lovely weekend and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!